I don't uh, try, I don't fib often, but if you're looking like this undercover as a spy, sometimes, uh, sometimes, Michael, you just got to get your freak on. Michael. You know what I mean? All right, let's see if we can get home without getting pulled over. And uh, for our cheese heist, one of my personal favorites, a spy fox, okay? Um, spy fox is great. We love Spy Fox. He's our man. And today we'll be playing, nay, living the role of Spy Fox. But just who is Spy Fox? Who is Spy Fox, Indy? <laughs> Alright guys, for this video I'm super excited because we are, I planned a cheese heist, a cheese protection heist, a counter espionage if you will, to see if we could unheist our own cheese. More than that, we have been equipped for our mission. Where's my spy camera? Here's your stupid spy camera! Oh, thanks, man. With a set of our very own super secret spy glasses. How do they look? Inconspicuous? <laughs> I hope so. So, you have your mission, you have your equipment. Are you up to the test? All right, let's go! I'm somewhere in the Alps, just without the snow. Hello, everybody, and welcome. Uh, yes, we are. We're on the mission. So, uh, let me give you a little rundown on the plan. So, the mission is get the cheese before the baby wakes up. We'll check in on the baby monitor while we're out and about, but we have everything we need. We, we look the part for Spy Fox Cheese Chase. We've got the glasses, we've got the watch, we've got, got it all. We're ready to go. One of the biggest motivations for doing this video today instead of tomorrow is I really liked how my hair looked. <laughs> I thought it looked cute. So, <laughs> life advice from Brandon. If you look cute, go for it. <laughs> Like a good cheese, it ages with fine wine. Wait. <laughs> Mission to go. All lights are still green. Who knew you'd become a spy in the same city your grandpa grew up in? A cop car just drove right past me. You had no idea. <laughs> you had no idea! <laughs> Two cops. Why well, just been sitting here? Sheriff drove by. We're good. Oh, I'm passing the other cop. Play cool. Play cool. Play cool. Dude, they're gonna know. They're not gonna know. They're gonna know. They're not gonna know. How are they gonna know? They don't, look. I mean, what do you think? I, I look good. <laughs> we, <laughs> Just checked the baby monitor. We're good. <laughs> oh, we're golden. Here it is. Okay. My dudes, we made it. We're going in. We're going in. <laughs> Great. Okay, love you guys. Bye. Excuse me, oh, excuse me. Hello, how are you? 
I'm happy. How are you doing today? Uh, whole whole milk. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. You too. Thanks. Mission accomplished, guys! <laughs> Alright, so, we got the goods. Uh, well, I also picked up some milk for my grandma, she asked me to, and for the baby. Uh, let's check the baby cam. I honestly can't tell uh, what's a stuffed animal in her crib and what is her. So, <laughs> we better get back. Um, she seems to be sleeping quietly. I don't uh, try, I don't fib often, but if you're looking like this undercover as a spy, sometimes, uh... Sometimes, Michael, you just got to get your freak on. Michael. You know what I mean? All right, let's see if we can get home without getting pulled over and uh, for our cheese heist. And we'll get back to this very good. Thank you guys. Okay, bye. <laughs> Might not be out of the woods yet. There is a Chevy Suburban behind me with one of the little spotlights. And I haven't been totally honest with you. I'm an undercover spy. I go to the speed limit. I have not received my registration renewal sticker yet, but I've renewed it, and so I'm a little anxious here. <laughs> and I've got one brake light out. <laughs> so, lay it cool, lay it cool. We might just pretend to work on a farm real quick and, and pull off, because it, I don't know, freaking me out. This is why I could not be a spy. <laughs> Can't keep cool. Oh my gosh, an animal control truck. What is happening in this county? Everyone is out today. Oh, maybe the herd is a fox on the loose. What is it like being so handsome, rugged, and chiseled, half cloaked in a shadow and living day by the light and by the night? It's pretty easy, in fact. I have to stay focused on the mission because right now, I just passed a little farmer's market booth thing that I love. They have the sweetest corn on the whole planet. Sometimes you need a little sweet corn. But you can't. You can't have the sweet corn. You can't stop. We gotta be back there for the baby. She doesn't know. She doesn't even know we're gone. Guys. We did it. Oh boy. I think we successfully pulled off a heist. Let's get to that cheese then. Uh, by the way, our cheese ranking is real simple. Winner gets four points, uh, second gets three points, then two, then one, then zero. And then we'll just rack them all up as we go, okay? Well, with the mission being a success, we have here a plate of cheese. Oh God, don't worry about that. We have here a plate, oh God, no. Don't worry about that one either. We have a plate of cheeses here. I will now, do the smell check on all of these. Ooh. Oh. Yes. Havar tea is not really there for me. Onto the cheddar, the jerky. It smells cold. The cheddar with ranch. It also smells cold. <laughs> the slice of provolone. Hmm. All right, so we've got uh, in order Monterey Jack, Provolone, Avarti, and then the last two, the two, the two cheddars tied for last. <laughs> hmm. No points for them. Now for the uh, the taste test. All right, are you ready? Avarti, down the Provolone. Became the Brady Bunch. Ooh. Final offer. Cheddar with ranch, provolone, Havarti, Colby Jack, cheddar jerky. Rack of points. Of course, it's not just how the cheese tastes and smells. It is how well it withstands interrogation. To the kitchen, my friends. To the kitchen! Today, we will be testing five cheeses in the incinerator. You know what mom always says? Don't forget cooking spray. 
I think the oven is nice and toasty. Let's do this. Oh man, all right. Both white cheeses have slid. They're melting, oh man, all right. Provolone was stacked for high by one to even the score, but it is gone. It looks like it's like a fried egg in there. All right. All right, I think it's about time for our pull test. So I'm gonna have crispy cheese on the bottom of this pan. I'll be right back. Once I've got to save it, I've got to save it. Oh, I'm not made for torture. Okay, bye. Uh, winner by far. Everyone else <laughs> didn't make it. All right, so now for the cheese chase part of this video. We have a plate of cheese here. Oh, look at that smooth camera motion. And a scooter all the way over there in the free throw key. <laughs> I don't know, I don't do sports. The object is to ride that scooter and scoop up a single piece of cheese uh, one at a time and see which one is the easiest to scoop up. We've got Monterey Jack, Pepper Cheddar, or Jerky Cheddar, uh, Havarti, Provolone, if you know, you know, and Ranch Cheddar right there. All right, so without further ado, let the games begin. Ranch Cheddar scoopability test. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> get low, get low. Everybody, I think that about does it. The results speak for themselves, and I think we have proven to ourselves that we can be anything we want to be when we're kids. Yeah, I think that's the lesson here. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate that you guys being here. Uh, this was a really big video for me to put together and a lot of fun to make, um, but a lot of stuff did go into it, and I really appreciate you guys sticking around to check it out. All that's left to do now is to Enjoy some cheese with a nice fine mozzarella and feel very fancy. Maybe make a fondue. A ton of cheese out there. <laughs> Appreciate you guys. I hope that you are having a wonderful day and that everything works out for you. Uh, not only today, but this whole week. Boom! Fortune cookie ending. Stay foxy, stay cheesy. Talk to you guys later. Oh, boy. Drove right past me. You had no idea. You had no idea. <laughs>